The northern Swains reefs are remote. They're a long way offshore, roughly from east of Shoalwater Bay to east of around Mackay. They also have extreme tides, very large tides and strong currents, with places like Riptide Cay suggesting what they're like. They have crystal clear water, but real problems with filming. They're the home of Red Throat Emperor. These guys love grabbing the baits, snatching them, taking off. There's also lots of coral trout. Here's another red throat. see the coral trout in the background. One of them decides you better have some of that bait as well. Another coral trout watching that bait very carefully. Approaching it cautiously, but you'll see there's another coral trout in the background, so there's probably some competition going on. Has a look, decides it's worth eating. Takes off with a lot. These are common or offshore coral trout, uh, quite different to the bar cheeks that occur close to the coast. I didn't see any bar cheeks in the swains. You can see these guys getting uh, quite stirred up. I can see the bait, but they're not quite sure what to do with it because it's uh, sitting on the bottom. There's one large one coming to have a very close look. Decides to grab the lot and take off. It's not only about coral trout and red throat uh, emperor, however, there's some very attractive uh, fish out there as well. So here we've got a coral cod. And coming into uh, picture shortly will be harlequin tusk fish cousin to the venus tusk fish but much more brightly coloured if you have look closely you'll see there's a pair of them and they usually go around in pairs here he is coming closer to the camera here's another one
they don't grow really large but uh, quite common in this part of the reef very popular in aquariums for obvious reasons and there's his mate in the background Because of the extreme tides, I was often forced to record in shallow water. Now the fish feeding at the moment is a pink-eared emperor, only a little guy. There's also some moon wrasse. Just watch the pink-eared emperor as he changes colour. So at the moment he's that fairly ordinary looking colour, there he goes, changes colour to a, a real variegated pattern. The black and white fish in the background are bullseyes. There's a couple of different sorts of wrasse and even a trigger fish. What you're looking at aren't fish. If you look closely, and we'll zoom in close in a moment, these are actually worms. They're polychaete worms. And at certain times of the year, all the polychaete worms on a reef will come to the surface to go through their reproductive uh, release of, of eggs and sperm. So there are absolute millions of them in the lights of uh, the boat this night. Something you don't see very often. Thanks very much for watching.